Now, you kind of failed to have noticed this on our coffee table here this morning. <laughs> it is a huge book. It's the history of Manchester United. It's meant for the coffee table, but you need a pretty sturdy <laughs> one to cope with it. It weighs 35 kilograms. The book's called The United Opus, and the plot's the history of the club. It also has a list of the top 50 players of all time. Now, amongst the top 50, in fact, the top five, is this man. Here he is, a certain <laughs> Dennis Law. A very good morning to you. We were going to show some pictures of you. Good story. morning. Um, what a beautiful, beautiful book. It's worth £3,000 and so many talking points, not least the top five players. Well, You're number five. Yeah, well, that's very nice and it's uh, very nice to be up in the... It, actually, it would have been nice to be in the top 50, but uh, top five. It's a wonderful book, I mean, tracing back from United right from the beginning, back in the 1800s to today or so it really is and there's so many pictures it's unbelievable it's like i think there's 850 pages in the book so it gives you a spectrum right across the board uh, of united i'm having to put these special I'm gloves on because this is worth three thousand pounds well you won't I'm be able get to because i'm going to get a picture <laughs> here we are of number five a certain <coughs> let me get uh, my goodness Quite it's good. heavy there you are dennis big smiley Quite face there cheeky little smile <laughs> And it's got exclusive interviews, and the money's going to go to, to Unif uh, UNICEF, the money they raise. Yes, which, uh, which is wonderful. Is a, have you found so many interesting stories in here? Had a well, quick look like you, I've, I've just saw a few of the pictures. Uh, it's so, such a big book that uh, it'll be nice to take. It'll take you about two months to read, but uh, once I do that, yes. But the pictures are fantastic. I mean, some of them that I've seen are just, uh, w you know, wonderful photography. Just uh, what I want to question top five so Bobby Charlton number one that well, question really well he's the oldest so I mean he's good <laughs> 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 Love it. hope he's not watching yeah he's old it. Bobby Charlton amongst the Eric Cantona you name them in yeah there, right? and of course uh, of course George uh, George Best should have been there when we did the uh, photography uh, last year I think it was around the about October uh, and of course the weather in Manchester was that was beautiful as normal, the sun was shining, etc. <laughs> but unfortunately George went into hospital just yeah. at that particular time and of course as we all know uh, it didn't come out. So it was a shame that uh, the three of us, I was with Bobby down in the old training ground, I hadn't been back there for 30 years so it was nice to see that particular ground again. Uh, but just to shame that George, if he was uh, still here we'd be proud of the book, uh, it's he marvelous. Certainly would. Dennis, thank you very much for coming in. Thanks. That's Pleasure. it from us. We'll be back Nice tomorrow. to see you. I'm sure that top five, sure that top 50 is going to cause an awful lot of stuff. <laughs> 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 keep talking for ages.